Hello, this is Martin. In this demonstration, I will show you how to create a room availability calendar for your website. What it does, it creates small calendars which you then can upload onto your website, which displays the availability of your rooms. So visitors who visit your website have an ID on availability before making any further inquiries. Let me show you how it is done. Let's go to the program, select the calendar view, in the calendar view select the web page. Now first of all you can see the background color, you can select the colors, the background colors, the month and the availability. In this case no units available is in dark red color, one unit available is an orangey color and say five units available a blue color and you can select and change it to your own liking. You can also change the font size the width and the height of the calendar and the height of the month. Now then you have the web page directory. Locate a web page, in this case just create a temporary file and select this file. This will be the location where the um, files are saved. Now then you have the option um, of the month. Okay, select the month. The month you select here is the first month um, of the calendar you create. So if you create July being month first, that will be your first month and so on. This simplifies uploading to your website because you don't really have to change, change much at your website. Now, now let's look at the availability. Let's reset this first. You will note that the availability for the first three days of the month is actually quite high. But for some reason you want to block this so you don't want to sell it online what you do enter zero in here save this indicating that those rooms are not available it will actually display this in a red color indicating that changes have been made once you are done exit now you are ready to generate the web page click save and a new web page is created and displayed. As you can see the first three days of the month are displayed in red. It's an indicator that they are fully occupied, no room available. What the program actually has done is, if I go to the directory, it created 12 small web pages. A calendar says yes with the color coding and a calendar. This is the full calendar. Let me open a um, the first calendar here. Now you will note that let us say it contains one calendar for the month of July only. So all you need to do if you only want to want to show the first two months is upload HTM1 and HTM2. So HTM1 and HTM2 onto your site plus of course the calendar CCS file because this contains the color information. So if you want to display four months, like my sample, upload the four first month and the calendar CCS.